on b5, threatening to go b6, b7, b8. So we have to take it. c6 with the exact same idea. Black has to capture it. d7 was the threat. Bishop takes g5, freeing the pawn with tempo, followed by promotion. So black has to take it. And this is all that white needed because now this pawn is not blockaded anymore. So we can go h4, threatening pawn takes or bishop takes checkmate. Black has two options, capture the pawn or bishop e8 check. If he goes bishop e8 check, we go king f6, followed by bishop e7, bishop f8, checkmate. There's nothing that he can do. We're right on time to checkmate him. So he's going to take, thinking he will be able to escape with the king. But no, bishop takes h4, keeping the king at the edge of the board. Black can start pushing that pawn, but it's not going to be fast enough because now black gets checkmated. Hope you enjoyed it.